It's September 6th, 2010, and I'm at the uh, inflow area on Millennium Creek Pond. And uh, in the next few weeks, we're going to be doing a enhancement project on the inflow area here. Presently, there's uh, four different tributaries to this spring that come out of the bank at two locations. There's the main one right there. Here's another one. And there's another one just under that bush. It's actually five tributaries. And then the uh, final one is right here. I've prefabricated a uh, log retainer wall for uh, the main channel on the inflow here and it'll be installed from where the spring comes down at a fairly steep gradient there in the back all through this area right here. And in order to install it, I have to uh, excavate the stream channel down. I will use a flow bypass system during construction so that we can divert the uh, main volume of flow around the work site. And this is where the uh, mainspring comes out of the bank. And over here, we have the other primary spring that comes out of the ground right in behind that big piece of concrete there. And what my plan is, is to uh, channelize from this area, this pond, or uh, spring, across the slope down in between those willows and into the main stem. And uh, the end result will be an increase in volume of flow in the primary spring. And uh, that should enhance the uh, amount of spawning activity by brook trout in the fall. My log retainer will start right from in about here. And I've got it prefabricated in a meandering pattern, so it'll kind of meander from left to right to left to right down through the center of this existing channel and uh, flow into the uh, primary spring pond. I'm on uh, the inflow channel, Millennium Creek, and you can see that some of these little side channel tributaries have dried up. And you'll see the reason for it here in a minute. But what we've done is, uh, over the last few days, is we've completed our channel excavation. We've got our silt fence right at the uh, entrance here. Earlier on, we had a flow bypass pipe that was at the top end of the spring and it was diverting uh, flow around the uh, project work area.
Now there's a lot more volume of flow in this main channel now. There's our uh, flow bypass system. We just pulled it off the channel here. And uh, we finished excavating a diversion channel to divert water from those small tributaries into the main stem here. So you can see there's quite a bit of volume that we've added to uh, the main stem. It's September 12th, and we pretty much completed the in-stream work on the inflow spawning enhancement project on Millennium Creek Pond. You can see the uh, log retainer 